still camped out here on this ledge outside of Moab. Been relaxing for a few days, catching up on some work and getting some video editing done. And lots of you guys have been asking for more day in the life and what we're up to on a day to day sort of video. So today is sort of an easier day to do that on. Uh, we're expecting some guests who we met in Mexico. They've bought a brand new expedition vehicle and are touring through the US at the moment. And they're coming to meet us here and we're making supper for them so that'll be uh, ready when they get here and so i thought this would also be a neat way to show you guys how we cook on a day-to-day -day basis or one of the ways we cook um, and so we're going to show you kind of a quick and dirty recipe that kara whipped up that's pretty great <laughs> and uh, how we make that using solar power and our 280 peso mexican segundo instant pot so let's go inside. We'll rough out this recipe real quick and uh, show you how we cook using solar power on the road. All right, for this low carb keto friendly recipe, we are going to be doing this in our instant pot. And of course, we're gonna be running this all off of our solar. Now for this recipe, you're going to need a couple tablespoons of butter and chopped up four chicken breasts, throw them into the instant pot and then chop up some ginger, garlic, and onion. And then I just add a few teaspoons of curry powder as well as a can of tomato paste and then put it in the Instant Pot on normal pressure for one hour. Good, you? Good. This is Darren and Kim from Flood Exploration. This is our expedition vehicle. It's a uh, Fuso based, uh, Mitsubishi Fuso based. And um, uh, her name is Anahita, which is the uh, Persian goddess of the sea. Very nice. And so we wanted it to have a feminine name like a boat because it's built like a boat. It's a, it's a fiberglass hull design, interior design like a boat. So, so we decided to make it a feminine name for his, the sea, like the like sailboats. And then we wanted something powerful. So, Anahita is where we ended up. That works. <laughs> it works with our last name because our last name is Flood, so it kind of has that whole water yeah, yeah. theme going on. That's awesome. Let's look inside. Sure. So for great use of space, the shower and the toilet is inside the door. So it also acts as a mud room. And so the toilet like just extends. Oh out yeah, that's when awesome. You need it and it retracts when you don't. That's perfect. So it's great. And it's a cassette toilet. It is a cassette toilet. Yeah. Yep. Very nice. And then as you enter in, you have the kitchen right in front of you. Uh, we have a Robusto diesel cooktop. That's right. <laughs> Here's our control panel, which very much looks like a boat. Yeah, for sure. So it has everything that we need and one spare so we can program whatever else what we think of as we travel along. To the left is our uh, bedroom area. Nice. It's a pretty big bed. It is a pretty big bed. And we have storage underneath. And then we have a secret door. You do this little button right here, pops open. Whoa. And then we have two drawers underneath there. The first top drawer, the small um, one is is only one deep, and the lower one is two deep. So nice. we have lots of storage. Oh, well, that's perfect. And then over to your right is our dining and lounge area. Nice. 
That's a nice big area. It really is. And oh, and the coffee machine. And their luxury Espresso. <laughs> Espresso. <laughs> a must have. For sure. And then uh, cabinets on top were an extra option that we chose and we're so glad we did now. Yeah, that's so good to have. More storage. Yeah. We're obviously all about storage. Yeah. <laughs> And I see you have an isotherm. We do have an isotherm. I think it's um, 60 something liters. I don't know the exact number. It It is holds quite a bit actually. Nice. And it can be a fridge and a freezer at the same time. And no, this one can't. Oh, okay. Um, our Waco, which is oh, now yeah. a Dometic owned product is um, fridge or freezer, but we just keep it as an overflow fridge. Nice. Oh yeah, that's great. Yeah, so we're still trying to get organized. This is our first week or two weeks in it. Yeah. So we haven't really had it completely set up yet, but we will. It looks great. Thanks. Hey, thanks, Kim. All right, so now we just need to add some heavy cream and some sour cream. And the exact amounts for this recipe will be in the description below. And then to make this recipe low carb and keto friendly, we are going to be using cauliflower rice. And this product is awesome because it is pre-cooked. All you need to do is heat it up. Perfect for life on the road. It's butter chicken. <laughs> 